and welcome to another edition of Marcos Spatula's Finest Cuisine Hour. And today we are going to be preparing some Mexican food. Uh, today we're going to be making mainly um, tacos with refried beans, veggie beans, and some. We mix it up with some nice chili flavors. So for today's uh, for today's session, we're going to need uh, basically one large mushroom chopped up, some veggie mince of your choice for the vegetarian. Uh, I'm using a can of Discovery spicy refried beans with jalapeno chilies, one medium sized onion, can of chopped tomatoes of your choice, uh, and just for good measure, thrown in half a courgette. Going to be adding some more, obviously, a little bit of garlic that I have here, and we have some dried chilies and some chili powder. Obviously, I may have some sweet paprika to flavour it also. If you have here somewhere, uh, yes. So, obviously. Your onion, of course, and uh, obviously, it's a, it's a very good dish. Finish, obviously, you need some accompaniments to go with the tacos, obviously, which is uh, I'm going to be using some basically some sour cream, finish off, maybe some grated cheese. We're going to have some absolutely fabulous baked aubergines too, mini aubergines that I have here. Uh, like I say, some sour cream, possibly some sweet potatoes roasted, uh, and also some, I like to use some organic brown rice. Some brown rice, what name's that there? Get rid of that now. Yeah, so... Obviously, the kitchen you know, doubles up as a laundry room, Chinese laundry room, authentic Chinese laundry room. You see, there's some uh, Chinese clothes here on the floor. That, uh, that, that's wins. He's, if they dry in there nicely, as you can see in the bucket. Um, very happy with that, you know, the way they dry in there. And, you know, sort of feeling here. Yeah, they get again quite dry. Anyway. That is sticking like a turkey. You basically got to keep stirring this. Obviously, veggie mince has less fat content, so you know it's important you keep stirring it in. Get your mushrooms in there also. I'm using uh, olive oil. Obviously, a little olive oil in here as well. And uh, it does look a little dry at the moment, but obviously, a couple of legs of uh, oil. We'll do a treat. Finish it off, just um, slice this in here. Yeah, I think it's right, I think. We'll put the courgette, slice in half, down the middle, lengthways. Just chop your courgette as, as, you, as you like in there. And uh, it's going to be lovely. Take your chopped tomatoes, obviously. Put the pan like that. And um, pour in your whole tin of tomatoes. Plus your, place your uh, pan in the recycling bin, of course. Now then you take your spicy refried beans and pop them into the old uh, Refried beans are quite uh, quite mushy, as you can see, like they they sort of refried, fried, and also mashed too. And also, get your whole your whole load in there. Mix all the lot up. Some people tend to add the chili powder beforehand. Here, I've opted to do it uh, afterwards, to be honest with you. And this will make quite a substantial amount of the sort. 
so okay. Well that's well that's cooking out there now. You turn it down slightly. Get rid of your cans. And what we're gonna do now is add a little bit of uh, sweet paprika to it. So that's done. I've got a couple of these dry chilies left here, so I can use any chilli will do, you can use fresh. However, you know, obviously the heat content depends how hot you want it. These chilies here will have seeds inside that, as you can see. The seeds start popping out, but I don't mind a bit of uh, heat, heat in the old chilli. And, uh, this is a dish that I've not made a while. I usually stick to uh, fighters, but this is a definite change. So. Okay, and here to finish the touch off, we have a good little bit of garlic, you know, for the uh, stinking filthy chilli. Filthy hot chilli. Ah. I hear that the, uh, the sounds have disappeared. Desmond, if you'd like to uh, change the, uh, the side over. Huh? 